Hey guys, how's it going? Woody here at SBFBuilding.com. Today's video, I'm going to do a real quick overview of a Dart SHP 302 82 deck block. This block has been out for a while now. It's, it's kind of controversial, not as bad as the, the Boss 302 block, which I'll have a bunch of videos about. But this block, and the reason why this block was controversial, to be entirely honest with you, was because of Dart's ridiculous horsepower rating. They originally rated it at, I don't know what it's at today, but they originally rated it at 600 horsepower, which is beyond comical. Um, if this block broke any less than 1500 horsepower, I'd be shocked. But the reason for the low rating is that Dart overbuilt this block tremendously. It, it's, it was just too much, I think, they were intending for a real good block to replace the stock 302 blocks that guys are breaking, but at the end of the day, this is what they came up with, and it's it's 10 times as good as a stock 302 block. So if we can take a stock 302 block to 500 horsepower, this thing would go 12, 1300 with ease, no problems whatsoever. But I get a lot of questions and guys worried that we're going to do a build on an SHP 302 block. They do their research in the meantime and come to find out Dart rates it at 600. So I get a bunch of phone calls. Guys are all worried. Um, and like I said, the, the reason for the rating is Dart really needs to sell three different blocks. Before this block, all they had was the Sportsman 302 block and then the Sportsman slash Iron Eagle. <laughs> um, so then they bring this one out intending to get more of the market share on the guy that doesn't need a $2,000 or a 2,000 horsepower block, sorry, but a guy that wants something that's going to build five, six, seven hundred horsepower on the street and he's not going to have to worry. But they have to keep disparity between three blocks so you'll never sell uh, usually the block in the middle. To be honest, I haven't used a sportsman block unless a customer sends it to me. I haven't used a sportsman block in a long time, simply because it's money wasted, in my opinion, for anybody less than 1,200 horsepower. Um, it's quite crazy, but thankfully Dart did it. Uh, at least they didn't underbuild it and give you a block that was marginal at best for $1,600, $1,700. They gave you a block that 99 out of 100 guys don't have enough money to build enough horsepower to break. With that said, let's go over some of the general features of an SHP 82 and how it's different from a standard 302 stock Ford block. Let's start with the bore sizing and capacity. 